Everybody wants to go to heaven, but nobody wants to die. <laughs> That's the cliche, and we've heard it enough times to know what it means. Everybody wants a fit and healthy and attractive body, but nobody wants to die to work out. Everybody wants to be wealthy, but nobody wants to save. Everybody wants to be, you know, to have a large income, but they just want to work 40 hours a week. Everybody wants to have a happy family, but they don't want to put time into their relationships or with their kids. Everybody wants, you know, um, great skin, but they don't want to quit smoking or quit doing the things and quit, you know, get out of the sun and get to do the things that take care of the skin. You get what I'm getting at, right? Everybody wants the good stuff. But they don't want to pay the price to get it. And here's what you must know. There is a price for success. There's a price for success in your health and wellness. There's a price for success in your spirituality. There's a price for success with your relationships. There's a price for financial success. There's a price for success with your business or your job or your occupation or your venture. There's a price for success. And that price must be paid up front, and it must be paid in full before you'll have the goods delivered at your door. So before you have the beautiful body, you're going to have to pay the price of the gym. Before you have the fat bank account, you're going to have to pay the price of sacrifice, of saving, and restraining yourself financially. Before you have the reward of a large income, you're going to have to pay the sacrifice of developing unique and valuable skills that you take to the marketplace that not a lot of other people have, and that's why you're paid highly for what you do. Before you have the benefit or the success of, of, of strong, meaningful, deep relationships with your children and with your spouse, you're going to have to pay the price. You're going to have to give up the time that is needed to put into those relationships before you can have the promotion at work. You're going to have to put in the overtime and the extra effort and do the things that the other folks at work are not doing before you can have a magical work environment where your team or your coworkers or your employees look to you for not just guidance in terms of being their boss, but for leadership. They look for you to paint the vision and, 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 they, and they follow you because they admire you for what you've done and what you bring to the organization. Before that happens, you're going to have to pay the price of becoming that leader through education and through personal growth and development. The price for success must be paid up front and it must be paid in full and anything else is delusion. I mean, sure, you could win the lottery. Maybe. <laughs> but you know what they say, right? 99% of the folks that win the lottery or win big sums of money or inherit large sums of money within just two or three years find themselves right back where they were before because they hadn't paid the price in advance. And so there weren't in here or in here the person they needed to be to handle the money that came out here. And so you may find at times that your talent can take you where your character can't keep you. But if you want lasting, meaningful success in any of those areas, then the price must be paid in advance and must be paid in full. So here's what you must do. The price for success is this. Figure out what sacrifices you need to make. Figure out what skills that you need to have. Figure out what time you're going to have to put in. Figure out what you're going to have to give up to reach your goals, health and wellness, spiritual, financial, relational, all of those things. Figure out what price you're willing to pay. What it's going to take, what you must pay, and then start paying it. And it's really that simple. The price for success. There is a price for success. And for every endeavor, it's different. But what you must do is you must figure out what that price is. Figure out what you must sacrifice or what you must give up or what you must do. Figure out what that price is. You can do that by talking to others that have gone where you want to go or have done what you want to do or have received what you'd like to have in your life. You can talk to them and ask them, what was the price? And figure out what the price is, what you must pay, what you must do, what you must sacrifice, what you must give up. 
and then work as hard as you can with as much focus energy as you can to begin paying that price right now. Because I don't know for how long you'll have to pay it. I don't know how long it'll take you to pay it in full. But you can start paying it up front today and continue to pay it until the tab is paid and success is yours. And that's the dose, guys. Well, make it a great week.